<laughs> Whew, what's going on guys Clifton Denny with on your own outdoors man it is a hot one today my god it's muggy it's been raining all morning um, I actually did this video here I don't know probably two months ago and then turned around and uh, and it was messed up so anyways I'm back out here now I'm gonna do it for y'all again and uh, hopefully I get it right this time right today we're gonna talk about some platforms so I got my trophy line saddle already on and we've got two platforms that we're gonna talk about do a little compare and contrast so we've got the honk platform that uh, bolts on right there to the top of your stick and then we have the trophy line wingman and I can tell you just right off the bat if you don't understand the big difference in between those two right now this one versus this one uh, I promise you by the end of this video you're gonna know what the big difference is and uh, and why it makes a difference so I'm gonna go ahead what I'm gonna do guys I'm gonna stay down here low on the tree so that y'all can see me um, I'm gonna hook one up on one side of the tree the other one up on the other side of the tree we're gonna climb up on them talk about them talk about the hot spots talk about the spots that hurt talk about um, you know weight they're pretty close I think the uh, wingman is just a little bit wider but they're pretty close in weight um, I'm not one of those guys that really care about the ounces I care about being comfortable number one we're gonna start with the Hawk the Hawk has a uh, it doesn't have the little pull strap um, what it's got is the daisy chain strap so we're gonna go ahead and go put it on the tree I'll show you how I do it usually it seems to work out really well so put it on the tree sideways Bring your daisy chain around as level as possible. I usually do the second biggest loop away from the tree. So you come out here, it's gonna be the second one away from the peg as well. Get it on there, it's on. Make sure this dude's good. When you turn this thing sideways, shove it down, locks it in place. But I can tell you for the purpose of this video, it's gonna have to come on down some or I'm gonna be up there in the trees, not be able to do anything. That ought to be just fine. So that's the honk, that's how it goes. You just bring it around the tree, like I said. If you leave it sideways up against the tree, come about the second big loop out on your daisy chain, put it on there, turn it, push it down, it locks it in pretty good. So now we've got the trophy line wingman. There's its, uh, profile how it sits it's kind of strapped it's got one of the little pull straps let's go ahead and get this dude on tree. so again like i said i'm gonna put them opposite sides of the tree bring this one around um, if you've seen any of my other videos you'll see that i always when i go up a tree i always leave um that loop that's got the ratchet on it I always leave that hooked onto my um step whenever i'm climbing up and down whatever i'm going to do um the only reason is i don't have to worry about trying to get two of them hooked one of them's already in place we're good to go all right so we've got them both on the tree i think we've got them where you're going to be able to see them um i'm going to go ahead and get this camera turned and set up real quick all right i think we're going to be good right there um got one of my pouches over here got my tether in it so again, guys, for the purpose of this video, I'm gonna stay down here low to the ground on this other side. So I keep my tether in one pouch, and then over here in this other pouch, I keep my bridge. Just uh, seems to be an easy way to keep it out of the way. You see me walking around with it on a while ago, so everything's not just dangling around, getting caught on everything. All right, boys and girls, we are up and we are set. So as far as easeability and putting them on the tree, they're about the same. Your platform, and as big as it is, wide-wise, again, we're about the same. So we're gonna go ahead and move around so I can talk about what I hunted with in Florida. If you've watched any of my videos, last year I spent five days hunting out of the Hawk Saddle exclusively, um, and then found out that I wanted to upgrade to this trophy line, because this trophy line's pretty amazing. So let's slide around over here. All right, so we're set up on the Hawk side. What I'm gonna start with on the hawk is talking about the daisy chain. And once you're up in the tree, um, I personally have not had the issues of some talking about using the daisy chain, the uh, stick wanting to kick on you and that kind of stuff. I haven't had those issues, but I have heard of them. So that's one thing. If you do use the hawk steps, 
make sure you learn that daisy chain make sure you're not putting them where there's a knot on the tree those kind of things because they are subjective to sliding a little bit so just get that out of the way all right so now we're going to talk about the issue that i had while i was in florida and i think you can see it here you can see there where this thing is biting at so guys listen when you go to get a platform i'm telling you those platforms it's got that angle down in the front degree down in the front whatever you want to call it those things are huge so what i found out while i was in florida i would find myself doing this a lot the reason being is it takes the pressure off the inside of your foot another option is kind of turning sideways like this anything i could do to kind of take my foot off of that hard edge the way this thing's built with that hard edge so you end up being out here on your toes or you end up with your heels kicked in here either way i promise you after about 20 minutes it is not comfortable it is painful <laughs> to be dead honest with you so that's the hawk side it is what it is it's a small profile um, little platform to put on top of a stick it's there will it work in a pinch yes but do i think there's better options absolutely so let's slide around the tree and talk about one of those better options all right so let's talk about this trophy line wingman so number one thing the curvature of this platform it fits your foot and so what it does is it takes away from that direct line of pressure in any one spot so as you can see here if i want to back my feet off like this the whole ball of my foot is still on that angle so it keeps it from being just that straight line like we see with the hawk if i come in up here again it just kind of goes with the natural curvature of your foot you can still come down here and do this honestly coming down and doing that the way that it bends down in the front it gives you a little bit more of kind of moving around you're not going to hook on the edge and all in all just your longevity in the stand i promise you is going to quadruple because if your feet aren't comfortable you're not comfortable there's really not another way to say that most certainly there are a bunch of different versions out there but again guys we always talk about bang for your buck this trophy line wingman is where it's at it's got the nice curvature your foot sits on it nice it's lightweight it's not insanely heavy it's not hard to use a stick's a stick they're going to get you up a tree but once you get to the top of that tree your goal is to be as comfortable as you can so you can wait out that buck and be successful so i'm going to go ahead get down off this thing we'll talk about some pros and cons of each one now that you've actually seen me climb in them and uh and get this thing wrapped up all right guys so we got them down off the tree now and let's talk about them again we've got the trophy line wingman and we've got the hawk step bolts on top of uh the stick so number one thing about the hawk step I do like the way that they clip together um, and you don't have that option on this wingman however it does have this so you just wrap them around cinch them down good it's going to be basically the same thing the big deal in between the two of them is comfort and i'm always going to weigh on the side of comfort and you cannot beat this trophy line wingman when it comes to comfort i started this video by saying do you see the difference you see that angle there see that flat hard surface that flat hard surface to the bottom of your feet is automatically a no-go for me um, for myself I'm gonna go with this wingman this year um, this is the one you're gonna see me using in the stand with my trophy line saddle 150 percent and again the reason being is your goal when you're out there is trying to outweigh that buck and if I've got something again guys I call ourselves the one percenters all the time if I've got something to help me one percent of the time I'm going to the only difference with this and a lot of those other products is this thing is gonna help hundred percent of the time if I can keep my feet comfortable just like if you can keep your feet warm you're gonna be able to last and stand a lot longer so uh, when it comes to buying a platform go check out the trophy line especially if you want one that's on a stick if you want a bigger platform get on trophy lines website we'll drop a couple links down here they've got some more options but uh this trophy line wingman is what you're going to see me using um so hey guys that's all i got for y'all today don't forget to like and subscribe hit that little bell up top you never know we're gonna drop product you just might need good hunting guys